in my group, uh, the funniest was Jay. There, there were other people that would come in and uh, put on a better show, but just funny to funny, it was always Jay. The, I saw clips when he was on your late night show. He was always really funny, and you were very generous to give him an outlet. I have a question about that. Do you? What do you think of that? Looking back on it, the rivalry and the late night wars and all that stuff. And do you like? Obviously, maybe you think it's a shame. Maybe like, how do you how do you categorize it in your mind? Well, it's um, overall it's embarrassing uh, because I don't want to be the guy who's uh, pissed off because oh I didn't get so and so because I didn't truly feel that way. You oh, didn't feel that way? No, no. Well, how did you feel? It wasn't my choice. You know, I no nobody ever came to me and said we would like you to host the tonight show. So, okay, they didn't want me to host the tonight show. So I could I can live with that. It wasn't as though I had made a mistake uh as far as I knew. Yeah. So and and uh I I thought maybe uh, we would just take our show, move it to California, but that didn't happen. Uh and, and I, be the tonight show. Yeah. And and I I think it probably worked out for the best. J Jay did a great job and uh, I would, I would, Hey, you know who else did? I'm uh, old. The, the guy thanks, with the, the thanks, gray yeah. beard, my friend, yeah. gray beard. We'll be right back. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, it, it, it embarrassed you just a little embarrassed. Uh, like, like you didn't like making it public or no, it, it was because uh, look, um, there, there are things one looks for in, in a friendship. Mm-hmm. And if they're there, you have a friendship and you hope you supply in equal the, the yeah. same things. If they're not there, you're not friends and that's that's fine too. It can be very painful though. Um, in this case, it wasn't painful, but let's okay. don't let's don't pretend we're friends. Right. Got it. Yeah. Was there a part of you with the self-loathing part of you? Did a part of you go like, well, you don't deserve it? No. Or, oh, good. No, no. Good. Oh, where, where, I don't deserve yeah. it? Yeah. No, no. The the part of what turned on me was, oh, my, I may never work again. Huh. So so I, I tortured myself about that. That's the thing that no one would believe is how but much it, people, it, talented it, people think I'm never going to work well, again. Well, in, in show business, it's true. You you may have to go to the end of the line. Mm -hmm. uh, and I, I see, I don't even know now if it's harder or easier to become you? Was it easier for me to become me? It was it easier for you to become you. What about Bert Kreischer? He takes off his shirt and makes 25 million. It's unbelievable. <laughs> I do wonder about that where you look back on that and you just go like, should you have been more private about it? Do you, was it your own hurt feelings? Pettiness, well, I'll, I'll tell you, I'll tell you what, what it was. The, the fulcrum of the whole thing was I, uh, called and I, I've mentioned this before. I called Jay to congratulate him on getting the, the job. And then Jay said, well, what will you do now? And I said, oh, I may do this. Oh, I may do that. I may do this. I may do that. And it was, I felt on both sides heartfelt. And, uh, and this is going to sound so stupid. The next week, this is a story in the National Enquirer. And, and it has uh, a hyperbolic, exaggerated version of what I said outraged, uh, steaming with anger, uh, bl blood spitting uh, like that. And I just felt like that, that was, yeah, that right. was so not, you got that was not necessary. Yeah. Uh, were you, when you got all this sort of other networks, uh, vying for you, were you, f did you, were you f like excited for yourself or flattered by the attention? Uh, sure. Yeah. Because I, I, you, like I said earlier, I went from a position of Holy gosh, I'll never work again yeah. to suddenly, oh, we got a Brandon Tartikoff's at Paramount and they're talking about this and Fox is coming in and uh, CBS is here and like that. Yeah, so it was, it. but it's show business. Sh ultimately, show business, uh, I, I'm, I'm now one of those guys, I'm officially on record as whining about my life and I have really nothing to complain about. Come to the right place. Yeah, I guess I did. Um, Nobody told me I'd be the first well, you don't yes. have to be. I'm not. I don't know how I'm going to roll them out. Okay. Well, I'd I'd like to be. What? Give me a pick a number. Well, who would? 
<laughs> no, now well, you want to know. Well, show? Now, wait a minute. How, this is who who else have you, you booked? The competition between <laughs> value, like corn pone values, Dave, and showbiz, Dave. Yeah. Because there's a you're well, a you're showbiz animal. Yeah. No, I. You I still want to win? I I think first is exactly where I want to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> 